for me, the essence, the experience of surfing is like be like super present on the moment, you know? You're not thinking about your job, about like your concerns. You're just like super present on what you're doing. I don't know why, but I got this intuition, kind of like this information that is some part of me that is clearing a lot of stuff when I'm surfing, you know? That it's clearing a lot of karma and balancing a lot of stuff within me. And sometimes it feel like as soon as I jump into the water and I feel like my whole body going under, like, I just feel like getting clean, like energetically, getting a bunch of stuff disattached from my energy field. Yeah, I started studying graphic design in, in the Instituto de Diseño de Caracas. They didn't have any idea of what design was. I found out that in graphic design, I couldn't like, communicate through visuals, through that visual language. I kind of liked it. Like, at the bottom of the whole thing, more than communications, I guess I liked the, the process of creativity, like sit down and create. The detachment part of it is, is a bit key, the detachment to the result. I'm not doing this to, to create a specific result, I'm just doing it because I enjoy to do it, and, and then I just enjoy the, any result that came forward without expectations. At the time that I kind of like choose more consciously to work with the spirit and to work with the spirituality in my life, uh, it was a time where everything was going great, you know? In my country, like, I just got right off university, with feeling super proud of myself, making my family, my friends feel proud of me. And I went to this trip to Costa Rica, and I have like a great trip. At that time of my life, surfing was kind of like the most incredible experience that I ever have. So that was kind of like, for me, that was the point of reference of the highest sensation that you can ever have. A week after I get from Costa Rica, I went to this peace awareness training. And in that training, the experience that I have, it was like way beyond any wave, any surf, any session that I had in my life. But the choice was to, to participate more in the spirit within me. But how are you gonna do that? I just know how to surf. MSAA give you the tools to work with the spirit within you. Yeah, of course, I got more involved in, in, with the MSAA, which I'm grateful and which is, I feel blessed for, for being part of this organization, but the choice was to keep following the spirit and working with the spirit within me. So you get to live with a lot of freedom because you don't expect any results. You can create those results and the blessings in your life without having the, the attachment. And I think that's a key for actually create those results. I think the attachment kind of like blocks you to create those results. My priority in life is my relationship with God. And because I have that priority, everything else that I do is like a game, you know? I plan to be an advertising guy, and I plan to be a surfer guy, and I plan to be a designer, and I plan everything else. And I just keep my priority and my focus in that. And it's funny because having that, that focus and the, the intention of like getting to that, into that level of consciousness, everything else just falls into place.